Uh, today I want to show you uh, one space modeling progressive die design module. Here we have a sample part uh, with some uh, features on it. We have uh, holes, uh, stamps, bands and some uh, punch area. To uh, process this part I have to go to the application area and select the space PDS design model. Design menu will be available. First thing we should do is set the part. I go and select the base face. Thickness will be calculated automatically. Then I just unfold the part. Depending on if you are using the sheet metal model or not, uh, Space PDS uses the same unfolding functionality like one space modeling. Do the unfolding. At this moment, our part is completely flat. The next step what we should do is to automatically uh, detect the features on the part. For doing this I have to go to the analyze uh, uh, menu, say find the bands, all bands are recognized automatically, find the holes, all hole patterns which are uh, circular are found. In this case I have to remove one because this will be done with the stamping tool. Define the punches. Punch definition simply select the base face and one of the boundaries. Select the base face. Select the base face. Now I have defined three different punch tools and for the stamp feature I decide to have a rectangular pattern, rectangular shape. So now the part is analyzed and the features are recognized. The next step is we have to do the uh, determine the nesting properties. Go to the nesting menu. And here, Space PDS shows you the 2D view of the nesting. Make my necessary changes. Filtrate that change of turning. Extraction I did it once. Change the strip width. And then I'm happy to say OK. The next step we determine the outer contour of this complex shape for calculating the strip. Now we are ready to create the strip. This thickness, with feed rate, number of stations. I select uh, 12 stations and I decide that the bending stations, which are usually at the end of the process, will start at the station number 7. By doing this, a strip is uh, calculated and modeled. As you see, up to version 7, we have the punching and stamping tools and from the station 7 onwards, we have the bending stations. This is the complete strip. Now, the next thing I should do is to create the tools. We have defined already certain features on the 3D model. They are um, attached to the to the strip so once when I go to the 
inner tools creation menu I simply say show me the defined holes these are the tools for defined holes show me the create the punching stamps create the stamping tool and I can if I want create indexing holes through parameters these are the indexing holes for the strip feed now I've defined and created the inside tools the next step should be definition of the outside stamping tools so I say show the necessary work plane and I simply use one space modeling functionality to create outside tools this can be done either here inside or the user can do it if he wishes also in the 2D modeling area and recognize the tool do some trimming finish one two so now I defined the outer geometry and simply say create now the outside stepping tool is created I can use the same tool for creating the mirror side mirror define the symmetry axis for example create this stamp the symmetry axis the tool is mirrored by doing this we have already defined the tools and now the next step will be the simulation First, we create the strip. Now, what I should do is simply select the tool and define the tool position. I say this tool, this tool, I can simply move the pool to the position. Will be position number one. And I go say OK. As you see, as you will see, uh, Space PDS will use this tool and do the uh, punching. Take the next tool. So this tool will be station number two. Then I say this tool will go to the station number three. those four tools select them together we'll go to station number four the stepping tool We'll go to station number five. And last two tools. We'll go 
to station number six. Having done this, I'm ready to do bending stations. Say OK. Go to bending stations. Select the bend position. Say OK. This is OK. Next bending. Final bending will be station number 12. Okay, now we are finished. Just I will show off the Layout. Here are, we have defined the tools and the strip, and now the strip layout is finished.